Okay, now it is time for this week's Fresh Finds. Each Wednesday, we team up with the Blue Zones Project Jacksonville to highlight restaurants with healthy options. We also bring you some delicious recipes. So today, we have Michael Milben and Tammy Massey with Mayo Clinic's Catering Kitchen joining me. So good morning to you both. Good morning. Yes, yeah, so happy to have you here. I know we're talking about overnight oats. So could you start off with Chef um, just kind of um, telling us about the ingredients as you start to put this dish together? Of course. So, uh, we have an overnight oat uh, dish. Um, we're gonna start off with uh, two and a half cups of steel oats, um, followed by equal parts, two and a half uh, cups of oat milk. Mm -hmm. And also with the benefit of this, you can also substitute between soy milk, oat milk, uh, regular milk. If you wanna do like a dairy-free option, you can always use soy or almond milk too as well. Mm -hmm. um, I have one and a half cups of plain Greek yogurt. You can also um, omit that if you would like for a dairy-free option as well. Um, you can add an additional uh, one and a half cups of milk to substitute that as well. Awesome, yeah, so overnight oats are really delicious, especially when you keep them overnight. I mean, the flavors just come by and that's what's amazing about this. Oh, yeah. So um, Tammy, could you talk a little bit about what the Mayo Clinic's kitchen, how that differs from your typical catering kitchen? Well, the Mayo Catering Kitchen, we tend to work more with the doctors who take care of our patients. And this whole journey started with uh, Don Musalem, who is uh, a, a doctor with oncology and integrative health. So we do a lot of Blue Zone themed meals for her oncology patients and for community outreach programs. Oh, so it's mm -hmm. awesome. And so I know that, Chef, you added some vanilla to that as well as we were talking. So yes. important for the viewers to know. And then some chia seeds, it looks like. Yes. So that just, so can you talk a little bit about the benefit of the chia seeds as you added that in there? So the benefit of the chia seeds and also the oats too as well, you have a, a lot of fiber that adds to off in there, uh, magnesium, protein, um, stuff pretty much to just to jumpstart your day. Absolutely. Um, Give you some energy, especially for the patients there, uh, right? Right. Yes, <laughs> right. Yes. So, um, Tammy, could you talk a little bit about how the Mayo Clinic works to make food accessible for people? Well, we are working with uh, some local farmers who do some uh, different, you know, versions of farming to be safe for our community. And we work with uh, a couple of different, like I said, outreach programs. And we promote... Uh, healthy eating because our bodies are our machines to get us through life and the fuel, the food that we put into it is the fuel that gets us through. So if we're not eating healthy, then we're going to have more life longevity than health longevity. So the goal is to be as healthy as long as we can and it's truly based on the food that we put in our bodies. Absolutely. Food mm -hmm. is medicine, right? Right. Absolutely. Yes. So could we talk a little bit about what's next for this dish, Chef? So after you add incorporate all the ingredients, it's fairly simple, uh, real quick and easy. You want to let the ingredients sit at least overnight, four to six hours to overnight. Um, and then in the, after the next process in the morning, you have uh, your finished product. At that point, you can add berries, nuts, any different type of the grains. Maple syrup in there, uh, mixing it up to sweeten Maple it. syrup, honey, agave, just any other ingredients uh, to sweeten, to change the texture, uh, fairly simple. It's also an easy thing to do with like your family, uh, kids to get them kind of into cooking too as well. So absolutely. fairly simple. Yes, absolutely. So this question is for either one of you all. How is the how is the partnership with the Blue Zones Project, how does that help you know the patients at the Mayo Clinic and the community as a whole? Well, what I've learned working, like I said, with Dawn and uh, our whole journey with the Blue Zone is Mayo views patients healing with food, music, art. It's not just medicine. It's, it's the entire package that we need to, to heal our bodies. And it starts with food. Absolutely. So as we wrap, Chef, could you just top off this, um, these overnight oats? Because I know a lot of people, like I do at home, we put our overnight oats in a mason jar yes. and then let it sit overnight. <laughs> yes. So that's a great way to do right. that. So you can just top them with berries, right, and nuts. Yes. Um, and then you're good to go, right? Yep, sure can. And um, you can also use the unsweetened soy milk, which really... Uh, for in integrative health helps with men with prostate cancer and women with breast cancer. That's amazing. I did not know Soy that. is yes. great. Yes, Unsweetened that's soy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you can see here, if you all can zoom in, this is just an example. This one has apples in this little tiny mason jar. Um, and so it's just great. These overnight oats, great breakfast. Is there a difference between overnight oats and hot oatmeal? So the difference is between at any time you apply heat to any food you're cooking, you're going to start to break down that product benefits overnight oats. You don't have to worry about that product breaking down. You get to retain all the nutrients you have off in there. 
Um, and it just completes the, the dish overall for sure. Absolutely. So there's the benefit there, guys. All right. Well, thank you both so much thank for you. being here. Thank you so much. I do want to remind people to make sure that you take the Blue Zones Pledge. The QR code is on your screen. It'll help you and make Jacksonville a healthier and happier place. All you have to do is open the camera on your phone. I'm sure it's in your hand right now. You scan the QR code on your screen and then that will jumpstart your journey on a healthier lifestyle thanks to the Blue Zones Project. Well, thank you so much, and thank we will you. be right back after the break.